Good day fellas, I hope you are ready for your daily dose of skill and what we are going to do today, today we are going to play with IS-4. I feel like I want to play with, uh, I suppose to say, unpenetratable overpowered tank. I'm messing with you fellas. I want to play with a Russian classic in a way, IS-4. This vehicle has a great camo. Camo? This vehicle has a great armor. Uh, the tank itself is quite fine. Oh, we have a good mood. We have a good mood. PP raised in the air and the <laughs> uh, nothing, nothing unusual, fellas. Nothing to see here. As you can, <laughs> even <laughs> even a mix uh, 65T has his PP raised. Anyways, fellas, we are going to play IS4. Uh, hopefully, we are going to have a great session. Hopefully, we are going to enjoy ourselves and hopefully we will do a lot of a lot of a lot of damage this is the plan this is the hope this is the dream the tank itself is good the tank has um quite good armor you can side scrap with the tank you can play hold down you have um relatively good gun handling well in my opinion it's better than average and obviously if you want to know uh more information remember index page is waiting for you there is everything from equipment setup to field modifications you name it um and if you want you can tune in today in the live stream today we are going to play with many many different tanks we are going to go for or, um, for field modification, grind with all of them or with some of them and we are going to make credits because it is a very, very um, special day for credit making, you know? This is the thing. Also, if you if you want to float the comment section down below, you can easily say uh, happy 18 years of experience, if you know what I mean, you can do that as well. Thank you, fellas. Okay. So, the first, the first game. I know this mother trucker is going to be quite dangerous for us. He's playing quite well. Hold down. I am aware of that. Um, and I kind of want him to shoot. Whenever he's going to shoot, I will start getting involved here. Beautiful. This gentleman just fired. So, now we need to let this guy on fire. He's not going to enjoy himself. I can promise you that, fellas. Meanwhile, good, 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 good. Thank you very much for hold down. I appreciate you. And now let's start our journey, fellas. It is going to be quite fun. How are you doing today? Uh, baboon. I do not shoot baboons. I meant to say I cannot see him. Another shot right into the cupola, which is always nice. <laughs> How I supposed to play this game? How do you want me to play this game, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen? How? <laughs> I, it's unplayable It is literally unplayable Boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen How do you want me to play this game? How do you <laughs> How do you want to play How do you want me to play this game? I just wonder How do you want me to play this game? Fellas, uh, I think soon we are going to reach the point When, when the game is Um Unfortunately, but unplayable, right? Just because we have PPs raised up the air, I have full hit points. I did not receive it any shots whatsoever. I am feeling like a tourist. Wherever I am looking at, I see the PP raised and I cannot do absolutely anything about this, you know? It is uh, against baboon duty, you know? Fellas, baboons are not uh, um, cannibals, if you know what I mean. I just can't do that, you know? My map awareness is very, very bad. So yeah, absolutely nuts. Okay, that was a very, very interesting game. And skill said I'm going to do damage. I'm going to do everything properly. This is going to be a nice one. And you know what is the truth, fellas? I would take this game anytime, any day over 10,000 damage. Because emotions are out of this world and uh, that, is, that is the most important thing, you know? Uh, game is about the shits and giggles. Game is about the laughs it's not sweaty try hard session all the time although we are having those as well right okay um now the question is are we going to find someone in this game or is it a game over this is the question boys and girls ladies and gentlemen this this is unplayable <laughs> I believe 
Sorry. Leo is saying, Meow. Everyone is stealing everything. Everyone is stealing damage. Uh, they're stealing my hopes, my dreams, and everything. Absolutely outrageous. How are you doing today? Enjoying yourself? Take that. Very beautiful gun of this vehicle. Now, jokes aside, it truly is. Anyways, let's teleport to the scoreboard and let's see how many baboons have we met. Okay, guys, we are back. First battle, the best game I ever had with this vehicle. 2.5 thousand damage. Considering how many paid actors we had in this game, uh, I believe uh, we can't complain. I believe we can't say, yep. That was that was pretty damn fun. Anyway, speaking by experience, fifth by experience, sixth by the damage, um, thirty-seven thousand uh, uh, credits made. Hip hip hooray! Let's teleport to the round number two and let's see how many baboons we are going to salute this game. Okay, fellas, we are back with the round number two. We changed a bit of the things. I decided to use an anonymizer because I met a lot of a lot of dancers um, in my recording session and the thing simply did not went that well. And what do I mean by saying this? I did not manage to show you um, anything nice, you know? So instead of instead of doing recording with anonymize without anonymizer, we are simply going to put an anonymizer on, and hopefully this is going to work um, a bit differently, and we are going to show a couple of the 5,000 damage games plus. That is the plan. That is the hope, and that is the dream. So uh, I hope this is understandable, and I hope you are not going to be angry on me. But you saw what happened in the first game, right? Sometimes it is getting out of control and i don't get me wrong fellas i do not mind to meet baboons uh i love meeting baboons um but sometimes the lines are crossed and i simply cannot show you uh anything nice right so instead of uh Instead of showing you average gameplay, I decided to do some changes. So, what do we have in this game? We have Karelia, we have a standard game. We are going to be quite aggressive against the enemies and we are going to make a hardcore pressure. Will it work? Who knows? But we will try to figure this out in a moment. My mission is to play hold down against the enemies playing around this area and hopefully we can show quite some good things. Now, once again, speaking about this tank, this tank is a good vehicle. I said that multiple times uh, before. It has a great armor, at least in my opinion. It has a great gun handling. At least I cannot complain about the gun handling whatsoever. Um, so you can shred the tanks like IS-7, like hot knife through the butter. I know Arta will come in a moment, but before Arta will come, I think we can spank this guy once again for a good measure. Beautiful. And and I think we can spank him once again. The thing is, IS-7 armor is just simply won't work against uh, against uh, heat ammunition, you know? He, he has no armor. And this tank has a beautiful hits. 340mm hits. Oh boy, oh boy, this tank is spanking some ass. Meanwhile, speaking about the IS-7, this IS-7 hates me. Oh, Arta incoming for another one. Yay! Well... I could have expected that to be fair with you. I cannot pretend like, oh really? Arta hits me. I am sitting in the open field against the Jeff. So, you know, I wish to say I could dodge this, but unfortunately it doesn't work like this with a heavy tank whenever you are um, playing in the open field. You know, there is nothing to dodge. Meanwhile, I'm trying to cross through the middle of the field just like so. The angle to penetrate us is very, very complicated. And those gentlemen cannot do that easily. All those skill you need to speak. You need that to speak skill. 60 TP manager to find a decent angle and decent shot. Fine, fair enough. Okay. Now the question is, can we start spanking them slowly but surely? This is the question. Beautiful shot into the driver hatch. Hip hip hooray. We have enough support over there, so I am not really um, thinking about going for a base defense yet. At least I do not really think it is the right way to do the things, at least for now. And all we need to do, we need to play against the 60 TPs sitting hold down. I know 60 TPs are dangerous and it is not so simple to beat them, but we are going to do that properly. Now, Mr. Mister, how are you doing? 
we can side scrap with this tank we can we can look straight forward to um with this vehicle as well we can even go in front by uh, showing our frontal track it doesn't really matter that much we still can punish the enemies right obviously trades against the 60 dp is never ever in favor of mine let's get real considering the alpha damage which we have and which 60 dp has uh, it is a uh, completely different story if you know what i mean in other words in other words 60 dp has a humongous advantage for trading but what 60 dp doesn't have and what we have is the gun handling so far so good this game has plenty of potential can we penetrate him oh boys the gun handling of this vehicle is disgusting obviously in a good way it is disgusting in a good way fellas who is not spotted e100 not spotted one to one b not spotted one uh, 140 not spotted at this point i am considering my life choices and i am thinking how i could get involved more in this game i can see that we are uh we are kind of losing by amount of the hit points uh i am aware of that but i am still feeling okay -ish. um how about if we would go for a base defense and we will start claiming the e100 life they have Kranwagen, they have e100 we are we lost like, let's say, three-fifths of our hit points, which is quite a bit, but we still have potential and we still can do a lot of things and obviously we still can save this game. It is not defeat yet, or is it? We are losing this game on 2.8 thousand hit points so far. The biggest pain in the butt, I would say, is this uh, Minotauro. Push on him, that means you are going to get a lot of attention from the two um, Artas as well, which is not a very good thing. And we need to keep this in mind, there is one to one B somewhere, and there is... Um, and there is 140. 140 is here, where is one to one B? This is the question. By the way, I'm not entirely sure is it the right decision for me to go like this. This is what I am afraid of. 1 to 1B is sniping from the back, that's fear I guess, can we punish the Leo, well we can try to punish Leo, such a bad decision by me, I fed this guy, well, he is down to one shotable, can we eliminate him from the game, I'm just going for a blind shot, unfortunately we cannot, one thing which is very worth to highlight with IS4 is low amount of demunition, I think no one would say IS4 is getting uh, a humongous buff if IS-4 would get extra 10 rounds of ammunition. Well, at least that's me, you know, that's what I think. Okay, let's see. How we can do this, fellas? This is the question. We have plenty of the standards left, only 3 hits and 3 um, high explosives. I think what I am going to go for at this point, I would try, do I want to try this? No, I don't even want to try this. I was thinking, do I want to go for a blind shot or I do not want to go for it and I made a decision not to go for a blind shot. The main reason being is unfortunately, but I simply do not have enough of the, um, unfortunately, but I do not have enough of the ammunition, you know, this is, this is the biggest uh, problem for me. Let's see, can we spank him in the side? Unfortunately, we are not penetrating this. Quite silly, quite pity, but it is how it is. How about this Mr. Kranwagen? We have a very, very nice angle against this gentleman, although he's shooting heat ammunition, and he is not looking for us that much. Okay, fair enough. For a very first game with Anonymizer, I will accept 4.3 thousand damage and 100 assisting damage. Uh, the game wasn't played perfectly, to be fair with you. I could have used my um armor so much better i bounced at only 1.2 thousand and this is laughable for this vehicle um i think i simply did some bad trades against the 60 tps which was pretty damn stupid in the same time re i really want to highlight this mistake from my side i decided to go like this which was just simply um greedy and stupid all i needed to do instead of looking like this i needed to go like this and i needed to take this position here if i would take this corner and i would be able to take this 
this corner in time, I would have um, a, as a bare minimum 2000 more damage. But once again, it happens, accept it, better luck next time. Let's see what kind of score we crafted in the end of the day. If I need to guess, I would say we are going to be probably first by experience and second by the damage. This is my prediction. Let's see, am I correct? 3.4 thousand plus 1 thousand. We are second by experience, but we are first by the damage. Well, close enough skill, close enough. Uh, all and all, we lost 48,000 profits or um, 48,000 credits because I fired quite a bit of the gold ammunition. And pushing on Minotaur simply wasn't a greatest option, if you know what I mean. So yeah, let's go for around number three and let's hope to get better than 4000 performance this is probably only one thing when i'm going to say no prokurovka now for real it is completely fine but the two artists uh, are going to be very very painful it is not going to be fun especially if i am going to get spotted this is not going to be fun okay let's see uh what i am hoping what I am hoping for, um, for EBR to spot enemy EBR or enemy light tank overall, right? I am going through the middle just like so. I am feeling very, very, very great while doing so. And what I want to see, I want to see enemy EBR making a mistake. Bad aim by me. I'm accepting this. By the way, for this, uh, for this map, I decided to go for ventilation, stabilizer... Uh, for ventilation, rammer, and improved aiming unit instead of going for stabilizer. Uh, the um, most important thing why I decided to do so is uh, I simply think this is going to be the right option for us to play. There is three light tanks and two artists. This is no bueno, fellas. This is just simply no bueno, unfortunately. But we will try to do our best. We are not going to give up, we are not going to cry about this, we will simply try to get as much use as we physically and possibly can, right? That's what we are going to do. I am going to take this typical bush here, the main reason why we are going to take the typical bush over there, because we can, we can spot people sitting around this area. This is very important thing to say, and we can farm quite a bit of assisting damage here as well. Meanwhile, enemy Arta is here, I can easily say uh, for our team, Arta is sitting in Alpha 2, so maybe our clickers will counter battery them, although it is very, very debatable is it going to be the case. So far, so good. By the looks of it, enemy team is kind of uh, um, locking themselves in the corner, if I can say so. Interesting. Interesting. Okay, let's see. Can I take this position or not really? The EBR is still doing EBR things. That's fine. Wait. Can we take the position? This is the question. Okay, we are in the position. This is exactly what we want to do. I am just waiting until he is going to turn and whenever he will turn we are going to snipe the living crap out of this gentleman. I kind of want to go for another one. I know this is quite risky stuff but why the heck not. Meanwhile this art is going to make my life horrible. At least that's what I want to believe. Ooh, enemy light tank got slaughtered. Nice, nice, nice. How about this Vaza? This Vaza is trying to um, give some spots for his team. But this is going, but he is going to get punished heavily for this. All I need to do, I need to hold this angle and I need to hold this corner and we are going to be completely fine. Wait, relax, take it easy and just wait until he will make a mistake. That's all we need. If he will try to overpeak, he is not going to enjoy himself. I'm all the time spotted. Okay, that explains the things. Since I am all the time spotted, that means uh, probably I'm getting spotted by uh, by some medium tank sitting around this area or something. Or maybe the same light tank. How are you doing today? Yes, fellas, enemy light tanks are done. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. At this point, we can chill and we can start punishing the enemy team. At least that's what I am hoping for. Um, obviously, I could take this bush and probably I should take this bush. Now, from this position, we should be able to spot the 1 to 1 B if he is being uh, uh, greedy. That's all we want to see. By the way, our light tank is brave. 
Our light tank is brave. He decided to go for a typical, for a really untypical bush. We can definitely highlight this. That is a very, very, very weird one. Hmm. I'm thinking how I'm supposed to get more use of this. I kind of do not want to lose more hit points. I know they have plenty of the sniper schnitzels. I am very, very well aware of that, but in the same time, I cannot make too many of them, too much of the bold plays, if you know what I mean. If I will push one, two line, I am going to die. If I push uh, five, six line, I am dead meat. If I will go in front like this, I'm dead meat. If I will go straight for the 55, I'm dead meat. At this point, we need to play via the time by saying this. Uh, I mean, we need to allow our Jeffs to do the job. Um, I think this is only one play which we uh, physically and possibly can do. Very, very hard session with IS4 today, fellas. Very hard session with IS4, unfortunately. And don't get me wrong, the tank is extremely nice. Um, but unfortunately, the things are not going that well as I would love to say. Let's see, do we have good enough angle to punish this gentleman? Even though if we do have a good angle, it doesn't mean... It doesn't mean we can spank him. Okay. Nice. Okay, let's start doing some damage, I guess. A lot of, a lot of assisting damage from the Mr. Grille. Mistakes we are made and obviously he messed up. I know how uh, bad the situation is looking like, fellas. I am very, very well aware of that. Um, bad situation not for us. Bad situation for our play, you know, for our score. This is a bad situation. If I need to guess, I would say they have someone sitting over there. I'm not entirely sure am I correct, but I can only guess at this point, right? Okay, we are farming this was a 55 and we are getting some assisting damage. I told you, fellas, I told you Leo is sitting in the back. Nice. You know what? I think IS-4 is not um, heavy tank. I would say IS-4 is light tank confirmed. I would say IS-4 is actually a light tank, nothing more than that, fellas. So if you played with this vehicle and you were trying to do damage, uh, wrong, fellas. You did everything wrong. Your life was a lie. All you are doing with this tank, you are spotting. Any questions? You know what would be funny thing if we are actually first by spotting? I know it is impossible, okay? But I can have the dreams. Okay, let's wait for a last shot. Arta bomb, beautiful, 100, uh, 100 is better than zero. And uh, can we rig brother in arms? This is the question. 907, can you pick up the kill, pretty please? And uh, Leo, 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 for brother in arms, for brother in arms. Unfortunate. Okay, in the end of the day, score wise, listen, this map is far away from being the best map for the heavy tanks, right? I mean, it's good when enemies are making mistakes and when enemies are saying, eh, shoot me, I am here. But sometimes the things are not working this way, right? And considering what kind of game we had, two artists, three light tanks, we were... Our hands, we are tight. So to have performance like this, I can't complain whatsoever. That was a good game. Thanks, mate. Even though we did not manage to rig brother in arms, we can say thanks anyways. 2.7 thousand damage, 3.5 thousand assisting damage. We are second by experience. Uh, and speaking about the damage, we are, ooh, we are in the fifth uh, place. Actually, sixth place. So yeah, not ideal. But all and all score, it is over 6,000 performance. Meanwhile, our EBR spotted 10,000. Okay, fine, EBR is a light tank. I am a heavy, okay? 
It's okay. I am accepting this. Uh, speaking about the credits, 8,000 credits made. And speaking about this performance overall, 3.5 thousand damage, 1.8 thousand assisting damage. This is still over 5,000 combined session. Um, I wish to say the map rotation would be better so we could play for um, raw damage, but unfortunately the things did not went that well. Am I happy with the performance? Well, to be fair with you, the first game made my day and I hope it made your day as well. That was a nice uh, uh, gift from the enemies and from the allies as well. Anyways, thank you very much for watching. Uh, if you want to tune in into the stream, you can do so. Today we are going to stream, right? Uh, even though usually it is a day off, uh, but hopefully I can uh, share some good emotions and a bit of the tears as well, just not to feel so sweet. Thank you very much for watching and see you very, very soon. Skill is out for today. Peace. Rrrr.